Hey everybody, what's going on? Hello, the alien says hello. I have a late night Saturday Timu haul for you. I don't think it's going to be very exciting, but we'll check it out. Uh, I'm waiting for some much better orders, but they seem to be lost in transit. First, I'm going to open this small envelope that was in the mailbox. How has your weekend been going? Mine's been going okay. What I've learned about kittens is that they need 24-7 entertainment. And what is this? Um, oh, well gosh, this was supposed to go, go in my haul from um, my Timu sponsored haul, I believe. If it is a ghost with a... Yes, it is. If it's a ghost with an LED light in it, and I don't remember right now how much it costs, but you do hang it, and then you click the little button, and it's got flashing LED lights in its cap. Nice. It looks a little evil, though, and it's got the same design on the same sides. So that was, yeah, that was supposed to go in my Timu Home Essential, Home Halloween Essentials. Oh, you can slow down. You can press the button and slow down the, oh, and you can just, okay, so it's got three modes. So it's got fast, medium, and then just still. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Can we hang that somewhere? I don't really hang it on the finger. I don't know. It should have something to hang it on unless I just cut it on accident like I'm like I always do. I think this loop was for hanging. Oh well, let's just deal with it later. Let's just deal with it later. Well thanks Timu, but you ruined my big thing. If by the way, if you haven't gone over to that video and that Home, Halloween Home Essentials video, if you would, or if you wouldn't mind going over there and clicking the like button on it, that would mean a lot to me. I get a lot of, um, I get more points or something, the more likes I get on those Timu videos, and I already kind of screwed that video up because I didn't give the whole spiel about what Timu is and get the coupon code out of my description and blah, blah, blah. I forgot all of that. So I'm at that video, that long hour long video might not even count after all of that because I forgot the whole Timu introduction. I was so excited to get to the stuff, but we'll just, we'll see about that. Okay. Well, that was kind of weird that they sent that separately. And if I would have known that I would have done that haul today. Instead of yesterday, I don't know, it all blends into one long day. Okay, let's open this thing. Sorry, I meant to open it before I started this video. Um, the little kitten is wearing me out. Lots and lots of attention that kitten needs. And meanwhile, my mom is in stage five renal failure and she's very sick and it was very thoughtless of me to bring the little kitten into the house right now. I, I, I will give her that. And also, I'm tired. And I had no idea. I thought it would be kind of... The last kittens I've had in the past have been mellow kittens. That have just wanted to cuddle and stuff. But this one needs to play all day long. So, we've had a long day of playing. Loki, he's in his his playpen. I'm trying to cut carefully so I don't cut anything in here. I don't let me get this side. It's time for him to go to sleep. Me, I drank coffee at four o'clock in the afternoon, so I'm not even sleepy. That's why I figured why not just film something at 1030 at night? What time is it? 1029. I was close. Okay. The first thing in here is I bought more of this Candy Bella. Now it says blue sky and cloud oil control pest pressed powder. 
And of course it's wrapped in plastic, but let's see if I can get it open. Because you've seen my other one, and this is something that, and I thought about doing a video on this kind of thing. This is something that I liked so much that I bought it twice. And so I was thinking of doing a video on things on Timu that I bought twice because I've liked so much. So this is one of those things. I wanted to buy another one in case they sold out forever or something. It's this mattifying powder or, or I don't know what it is. It's a gel. If you know Mally Beauty, she's got a product like this, but it's not this color. And you can use your finger or you can use this little um, makeup pad it comes with and just hit the little parts that are shiny and it'll mattify those just like that all right anyway it's very I really like it it's about four dollars well here let me tell you how much it is it's four dollars and four cents and I posted it on my community feed too when it came back in stock so it is there, but I will post this order in my description. I can't post the ghost because I don't know. The ghost is in my, if you, I didn't cut anything out of my Halloween home essentials in the description, even the sold out things, I didn't cut those out of the description. So you can find that ghost listing if you really want that little ghost in my in the description box of my Halloween home essentials video. Okay, the next thing is not that exciting. It's just a pack of three it's loud. Three scouring pads attached to handles. So I like to clean with these. Well, I don't know. I've never tried these before, but sure. I mean, they'll do the job. And there are three of them in this bag. And for three of them, I paid $2.98 for a set of for a set of three. Do I need to bring this up a little? Did a fly just fly in my mouth? One time my nose was really stuffed up. I, I don't want to tell this story. Okay, well, I already started it. One time my nose was really stuffed up all day. And finally I got, I blew my nose because it was driving me crazy. And a full-on, full-sized house fly came out of my nose. That's what was stuffing up my nose all day. Oh my gosh, that is so gross. <laughs> I can't think of it now. Even when I think of it now, I go like this. Ugh. Ugh. But yeah, I mean, my nostrils are big enough for a full house fly to get up in there. Okay, this is something I've bought in the past, and I bought again. So this is another thing that I bought two, twice. And this is a two-pack handle um, bathtub scrubber for... I'm trying to read it without my glasses. But I can't. I think it said 388 For three eighty eight, but I was partially refunded. They are now three oh eight for a pack of two of these, and they really got my bathtub clean the last time I used them, and I wanted more. Now I know you can probably get. Hold on. Hey. I know you could probably get something like this at Dollar Tree for a dollar seventy-five, but a pack of two for two eighty-eight, or whatever it is now, a pack of two for three oh eight. I don't know. I mean, you could probably get these at Dollar Tree, but I like them. So yay for cleaning! Yay for cleaning supplies. They are very rough. But not as rough as these scouring pads. Okay, the next things in here I wanted to check out, which is why I'm doing this so late. Because I was going to kick back and do some diamond painting. But I thought I ordered... A, now, I accidentally ordered two different diamond painting kits. 
I think that's what this is too. Let's look at this one first. I thought I got one that had a case and everything. I don't know, you guys. I am new to the world of diamond painting. So I don't know what I need. I mean, I've just started doing it. So with this kit, which is, I, and I might not even be able to tell you, okay, I think this one is, was $4.99. No, this one might have been $7.68. I don't know. I won't, okay, so it comes with a roller. Now, somebody in comments tell me what you do with this when, what do you do with this thing, this roller? when you're diamond painting. I'm assuming when it's done, you put something on top of it and roll them all to seal them all down more. I don't know. Somebody tell me what this tool is for. And then I know this tool, well, this is a little drawer and these are probably to put extra beads in. And these are probably labels in case you want to put the numbers of the beads the color, bead colors on the little things. I'm just guessing. Here's some of that wax or putty or whatever. And then here's a tray to put your little diamonds in, I think. Now, if I'm wrong, please correct me. And so it comes with that. It comes with, okay, a case for beads. So... Okay, if I'm starting a project, I can put some beads in each one and then use these labels right here to label my beads. I don't know, whatever. I, or I'll forget the colors. Unless I just count one, two, three, four, five and remember that I did it that way. Um, that's what that is. Then I have no idea what you do with this thing. What do you do with this thing? Somebody tell me what you do with this thing scrape things with it I don't know okay so it came with that it came with some more little bags little bags it came with a tinier tray then it came with a bunch of tools it came with some tweezers to pick them up if you screw up and then it came with different tools but what do you do with these things on the end you guys are the end are the end things for if you have like more than one diamond and you can use the end of it to put like several down at one time let me know what the ends are supposed to do this one has a flat end See, I have no idea what I'm doing. All I know is, all I've been doing is, yeah, just using my little tool, picking up one at a time, putting them down in the little painting. And somebody said, oh, you got to get one of those tools to pick up a bunch at one time. Well, I don't have one of those. And then it comes with another little tray. So that one was, this set was $7.88. And I'm going to put all this stuff back. What I really wanted was like a sturdy carry-on case, but I must have clicked the wrong carry-on case. I mean, no, I'm sorry. Like, I'm not going to carry it on a plane. But that I must have picked the wrong... And I know it was there, but I must have clicked the wrong thing. They had all these different options, and I didn't know what I was doing, you guys. And so to that point, I got another one, and I think that's what this is. Unless I'm mistaken. Wait, where did this come from? Uh-oh, was this supposed to go in there? I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know what that came from. Anyway, let's open this thing. Yeah, here's this. Okay. Um, I did get some sleep today when the kitty fell asleep. Then I fell asleep and we had a nice nap together until the kitty. They are funny when they wake up. They just spring up out of bed and want to play immediately. Just like when they fall asleep, they could be playing and playing and playing. And then all of a sudden they just go conk and conk down. 
Clover is over here behind the camera sleeping. She's kind of happy that the kitty's in bed too. This is pretty much the same of what I just got, except it was $4.99. And it comes with a bunch of trays. It comes with trays. It's supposed to be a, I don't know, it comes with trays, trays, putty, uh, labels. Really? Like, I think I just bought the same thing from the same seller. Except it does not have the, and then it just has a little, um, it's got tweezers. It's got these pens, more of these little pens and a set of tweezers. So this one has two ends. I don't know what that does. Somebody tell me what these things do, what the ends do, please. I would appreciate it. I need to learn. Okay. And then it comes in a bag to keep it all in. So yeah, that's why this was $4.99. The other one came with a little bit more, so that was $7.88. So diamond painting, now the thing that I've learned is you can't really diamond paint when you have a kitten around. It's very a very rambunctious kitten. It's impossible. He will jump on your beads or your painting or your whatever, and it fills me with sadness. Okay, the next thing in here, everybody's going to laugh, is a budget planner. Oh yes, we're going to start budgeting. At least I am. Um, listening to the doctor talk to my mom about her um, life expectation and stuff on dialysis. And it was all very sombering. And also the fact that the, the extent of dialysis she's going to have to have every week. Um, made me realize that soon this is all going to fall on me if we want to keep this house. And so I got to start. It's uh, The Timu fund for me is about to be over. But this is a cool budgeting book. You got your monthly budget where you can fill in all these categories. And then you've got budget goals and a checklist and date, income, savings amount. And then a little calendar down here that you can do whatever you want with. And then here you've got expense tracker papers pages and monthly report okay they all kind of look the same so here's a little spending analysis wheel you can fill in monthly budget review and then a debt tracker so it's got a lot of useful tools in here if you use them they it looks like and then you can put your annual goals here. I don't know why I didn't get the pink one. I think because I wanted to be... Oh, maybe pink was sold out. So I got black and silver. And this was... It is $4.83. I like the little rainbow thing going on right there. Oh, I need some kind of a thumbnail. How ironic that I'm showing a budget planner on a Timu haul cheese i'm too tired to smile cheese okay there's that and then last but not least we have another mug i'm going to do a video showing all the awesome mugs i've gotten from timu and a few from etsy and a few from amazon i like mugs they make my coffee experience that much more special. Okay, let's get this open. I was trying to watch that new show on Netflix called Painkillers with Matthew Broderick in it. But man, it started to depress the hell out of me. I had to stop it. I'll try to watch it again. Okay, highest quality. Sing in the hot air balloon. Enjoy life. 
They have the funniest things on with these little sing in the hot air balloon, enjoy life. Okay, next time I'm in a hot air balloon, I will sing. I was in a hot air balloon that crashed. The one time I've been in a hot air balloon, it crashed, but fortunately we were pretty close to the ground, so my leg just got all black and blue and messed up. Nobody was hurt, but uh, yeah, I don't really want to go up in another one again. That was enough for me. Okay, this is a really cute, cute strawberry mug with a lid, and it's got a little hole in it. Does it come with a... Yeah, it does. Okay, it comes with a stirrer. Is it in one piece? Hold on a minute. I'm trying not to be too loud because, okay, it comes with a straw, a, a glass, a glass straw. So I've been looking at these for a really long time and I have been wanting them, wanting this one for a while. And I finally said, I'm going to buy it. So the design goes all the way around the side and smile for some kind of a thumbnail thumbnail. Ugh. That didn't look very convincing. I don't know. Everything's tilted, I think. But anyway, so that's that. What did I pay for that? I paid $574. It is now $1187. Now, I don't know if I, I got it on one of those spin the wheel deals or if the price really went up from $584 to $1187. That's insane. But I think I got it on one of those spin the wheel around the square thing and you get 70% off of something because I, I don't know. I can't imagine the price going up that much on its own. So I think I got a discount on that. All right, here we go. 22 minutes. All of my all of my videos seem to be 22 minutes these days. Uh, if I get anything else tomorrow, I will haul it. But I also tomorrow I have to review a vacuum cleaner. Please watch that video. Please, even if you just watch it for a few minutes, please watch it and say something like, "Cool vacuum, brah." But it came in the biggest box. Wait, let me make sure there's nothing else in here. I don't think there is. Okay. It came in the biggest box. I could barely get it in the door. It did, I mean, like, how big is this vacuum cleaner? I'm going to try to film the... I'm going to take this thing downstairs and try to film the box opening of it tomorrow. I think I'm going to start out here and read all the specifications about what a great vacuum cleaner it is. Then I'm going to film the box opening and then I'm not going to film myself assembling it. But then I'll film myself vacuuming part of a room. That'll be the most exciting video I've done on this channel. Vacuuming. But it came like it, it was kind of the offer to review it came as kind of a godsend because I accidentally broke our vacuum cleaner the other day because I just got too enthusiastic with it. And so then all of a sudden someone contacted me and asked if I wanted to review a state of the art vacuum cleaner. So that's exciting. So that happened. What is this? Oh, this is my, um, tripod leg. I didn't realize that was there. All right. Good night, everybody. For me, it's good night. Or if it's morning or afternoon or night for you, I hope it's a good one. And I love and appreciate all of you guys. If you're new, thank you for subscribing. And thank you for hitting the subscribe button if you're just popping by and you want to stick around. And thank you for hitting the like button. That helps my channel a lot if you do. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow, and the alien says goodnight too, and how do we stop this thing?